Welcome back to another edition of What the is Mortgage Marketing Anyways with Nick Carpenter. I don't even know if that's the what this is going to be called, right? But just messing around with different name titles. Uh, what I want to share with you today is one way that you can be an animal with your mortgage marketing. If you're looking for a way that you can attract realtors, get their business, help them grow their business, and then you in turn get the home loans. We're going to talk about one strategy today. This is coming straight out of the Loan Officer Strategy Guide. If you haven't already got your copy, make sure that you grab this. It's available right now on Amazon or at the or at uh, the website is loanofficerstrategyguide.com. So it's full of awesome, awesome ideas. And what I'm going to share with you today is actually, um, it comes from Strategy 17 in the guide about doing monthly mortgage marketing updates. Okay, now. Generally, when somebody hears to do a mortgage update, um, it's super boring, right? That, that's why everybody just copies the stuff that Barry Habib puts out in MBS Highway. It's the reason that people just copy and paste the Fed updates when other people are sharing that kind of stuff. Because in general, mortgage updates are boring. It's hard to spice it up, make it sound interesting, make it sound like something people actually want to pay attention to. And so what if you just didn't even do, what if it wasn't even focused on being a mortgage market update, right? What if there was a way, like we talk about right here inside the guide, what if there's a way that instead of talking about mortgage updates, you kind of talk about what people actually care about and then you sneak in, you sneak in the mortgage updates. What's cool about the strategy that I'm gonna share today is this is a way that you can, um, something that you can do on your own for your own personal database. It's also a really, really good way that you can start sneaking in to a realtor's database and have the realtor start promoting you as their mortgage partner, all right? Because it's gonna really take two people to pull this off. And so ideally, you know, you're gonna need a partner to do it to your database. And any real estate agent that you work with is gonna need a partner to do it to their database as well. Or they're gonna need some assistance because they might not actually know how to pull this off, right? So Real simple, what you're gonna do is just sit down at a table. You know, I'm just sitting here at my desk right now. You're just gonna sit down at a table and you're gonna have two chairs where the realtor is next to you, the loan officer is next to the realtor, and you guys are shooting the video together, all right? And what you're gonna do is you wanna basically cross promote each other, right? Um, now, if you think about this in a perfect world, the way it's gonna work is you're gonna to go to a real estate agent and you're gonna ask them, hey, when's the last time you sent a video update about the market to your database. And most likely they're gonna tell you that they've never done that or that it's been a really long time. And obviously if they say that they just did it last week, this may not be a strategy that you wanna implement right away with that particular person. But 99 out of 100 real estate agents, they're gonna tell you that they've never done this and they don't even know how to do it, okay? So we're gonna help them, we're gonna help them. And for that help, we're gonna also get a little bit of shine for ourselves, right? And that's going to be that's going to be the awesome part. So what you're going to do again, sit down at a table like this. You can pull out a camera. I'm just shooting this with a Logitech webcam. It's real easy. You can obviously go any you know higher level that you want, right? You can shoot with your cell phone. You can shoot with some of these cameras you see back here behind me. A lot of options. All right. Um, I'm just for simplicity. And so if you're already sitting at your desk, shoot with your cell phone or shoot with your webcam. If you're out and about, just shoot with your cell phone, right? Um, just make it super easy on yourself. You can always improve the video quality, but as long as you get started, you know, that's what's going to maybe at some point motivate you to want to improve the quality. I see some of these people that they just never start, right? They just, uh, they have the idea to get started, but they just let the, the video equipment or some like little things just be the speed bump that stops them from ever getting started. And that's, that doesn't make any sense. Um, done is definitely better than perfect, right? So sit down at a table, you're going to introduce the realtor and then the realtor is going to introduce you. Then the real estate agent is going to give like about one minute, one and a half minute um, update in terms of what's going on in the real estate market. Then you're going to be able to give your update in terms of what's going on in the mortgage market. Then everybody's going to give their contact info. Okay. So here's a, just a quick, quick example of what that could look like, right? I'll come over here as the realtor. I'll come over here as the loan officer, all right? So I'm gonna go like this. I'm gonna start off, the loan officer is gonna be the first person to kick off and they're gonna say, what's going on? I wanna introduce you to the realtor that you all know, like, and trust. He's the man that you know is gonna come through for you. 
when you need to buy a home, sell a home, or invest in real estate right here in Huacow, I want to make sure that you are introduced to Nick Carpenter. And then Nick is going to go, oh, thank you so much. Guy, I want to introduce you to the only loan officer you need to know for anything mortgage related here in Huacow, whether you're trying to buy a house, refinance, or invest in real estate. This man right here knows exactly the program and the best way to make that happen for you with the least amount of money out of pocket, the least amount of closing costs, and, and ultimately the best mortgage program that's going to suit your long-term financial goals. Introducing Nick Carpenter. All right. Now, then the real estate agent is going to uh, give their update. Okay. It shouldn't be that long. It should only be about a minute, minute and a half. Uh, what I typically like to say is something like, um, talk about the, the best selling neighborhood, talk about the best selling zip code. Uh, what's the average days on the market? What's the average price per square foot? What are the features that are super hot? What are the features that are going out of style? Um, any of these kind of things, right? Just pick three or four big topics to hit on and just smash out an update, okay? Again, really important that you keep it timely. You don't want this video to become five, ten minutes long. It needs to be a two to three minute video, okay? So the realtor is going to give one and, a, one and a half minutes of updates. Then it's going to be the loan officer's turn. And as a loan officer, you might just say one or two things. Hey, listen, rates are going crazy right now. If you bought a house between... January 2017 and November 2018, there's a really good chance you could save money on your monthly mortgage payment and potentially skip a payment with no money out of pocket. And reach out to me. Let's see if this is a potential uh, for you. And I hope you're doing awesome. Right now, at the end, you're going to basically say, How should people get a hold of you? How should people get a hold of you? And you guys give out your phone numbers, your website, your Facebook page. It's a couple of people, a couple of ways to contact you. And uh, then that's it. Wrap the video right now. Once you shoot it, leave, right now, do me a favor. Leave a comment down below if you feel like you could easily shoot a video like that. Right. Or leave a comment. What else would you need to know in order to make this happen for yourself? All right. Now, once you shoot this kind of video, again, keep in mind, this is just one of the strategies that's inside the official loan officer strategy guide available at loanofficerstrategyguide.com. And so when you shoot the video, what you have to do is, and really the most technical part is creating the Facebook audience. Okay. Is the pretty, pretty is, it's not like super difficult, but there is a little bit of tech to it. So you can just Google, like create a Facebook custom audience. And there's a pretty simple, but basically just go into the ads manager. There's an audiences tab. And then from there, you can upload a file um, like you have with your database with names, email addresses, and cell phone numbers. And then what will happen is Facebook is actually going to create an audience of only the people on your list that you can run an ad to. So what's cool is number one, depending on how exactly you're doing this, if you're a lender, you just got a realtor's entire database inside your Facebook ads account, or you just help that realtor put the database into their Facebook ads account, you know, depending on exactly, exactly how you're structuring this. Right. And once you've done that, that is very powerful. Now we can put a video out in front of all those people. You're already going to know it's going to people that know, like, and trust the realtor. And you can just put a, sh a little small budget. It just only has to be like $5, $10, $20 a day, just depending on how many people are in the audience, right? If it's, if there's a thousand people in the audience, you can probably get away with like $10 a day. Um, if there's 5,000 people in the audience, you might want to put it on 20 bucks a day. And you can help that realtor to get in front of their entire database over one weekend. And so this is a cool way that like the people that see the video on Facebook, they're already going to know the realtor, right? That's the cool part. Now, because of the fact that they already know the realtor, they probably have a little bit of trust in that agent. We can be able to, uh, it's like we borrow the trust from the realtor and now the people are going to have a trust factor in you because of the fact that you're on video with the agent, right? So it's a really, um, man, this is just one way that you can really be an animal with your mortgage marketing. If you're trying to go out there and just be completely different, right? This is a completely different strategy than what most loan officers are trying to do today um, with the Monday cold calls and all that kind of thing. So this video is cool because if you think about what a realtor wants, right? More than anything else, a realtor, they want to be a local celebrity. They want to be out and about and have people recognize them. 
They want to have people call the office and, and do business with them just because they know who they are. And when you do this kind of strategy, they are going to get recognized when they're out in public. They're going to be at a restaurant. They're going to be at the mall, at Target, wherever they shop at. And people are going to start recognizing them, especially if they have a decent database. And if you're doing any retargeting to people that are engaging with your Facebook ads and, and some of those kind of things, right? It's pretty easy to create um, a local celebrity out of an agent. And then their business is going to increase ex exponentially. And then as a result, your business is going to increase, assuming you're able to keep that relationship intact. Um, again, this is just kind of one of the strategies that we that we got off in the local um, I mean, the official loan officer strategy guide. It's also something that we do inside the Legion of Loan Officers. You know, sometimes having the book is awesome, right? This book, there's some amazing, great information inside the book, even though I may be slightly biased. But if you put it into practice, you will 100% make more money. Um, the Sometimes, though, having the knowledge isn't enough. Sometimes you need support. You want a community to be around you, to lift you up, to cheer you on when things are going bad or good. Um, to, to lift you up and remind you that you can do it, that you're better, that you, you're you worthy of all the goals and, and desires that you have in your heart. And if you want to be around a group like that where it's a camaraderie, there's a brotherhood involved, that's what we have inside the Legion of Loan Officers. I'd love for you to check that out, legionoflownofficers.com. Do me a huge favor right now. Make sure that you go down, drop a comment, tell me when's the last time you've done a mortgage market update to your database and have you ever done it on video? Also, make sure that you give me a thumbs up, subscribe to the channel, hit that alert bell so that you can know that anytime we put out new videos, you're going to uh, be able to get to them first so you can have a jump start on your competition. I hope you have a great day. We'll see you next time.